What's up, I'm Jeff Haynes from Tech Bargains, and this is the video review of the HP Pavilion DV6 t laptop. Whenever a new processor is released, computer manufacturers spend a lot of time updating and customizing their systems to take advantage of the new hardware. HP recently updated its entire line of laptops to take advantage of the Ivy Bridge processors. So does the addition of Ivy Bridge turn this DV6 t into the ultimate entertainment laptop? Let's find out. The Pavilion DV6 t that we reviewed was powered by an Intel Core i7 3610QM processor running at 2.3 GHz that can be boosted up to 3.3 GHz via turbo, and it comes with 8 GB of DDR3 RAM. The system comes with an NVIDIA GeForce GT 630M video card with 1 GB of graphical RAM, which displays content on a 15.6 inch HD Brightview LED backlit screen with a native resolution of 1366 by 768 the laptop comes with a 1TB hard drive spinning at 5400 RPM, as well as a Blu-ray player Super Multi DVD Burner Combo Drive. This computer also packs three USB 3.0 Super Speed ports, as well as one USB 2.0 port and HDMI and VGA ports. Rounding out the system specs are an HP TrueVision HD webcam, Beats audio speakers and subwoofer, and full Wi-Fi support. Clearly, one of the first things that stands out with the DV6 t is the inclusion of the Ivy Bridge processor, which purportedly held some advantages over the Sandy Bridge processor. According to Intel, these chips are slightly more powerful while using less power and packing slightly better graphics. In general, we noticed that through each test we ran, ranging from web browsing and multitasking to gaming, this laptop seemed to run a bit faster and smoother than comparable systems. We also noted that the power draw was considerably less than some of our Sandy Bridge systems with decent battery life. We also found that the multimedia presentation for the laptop was pretty strong as well. The display was very good when it came to presenting visuals for movies and games. While the DV6T that we reviewed didn't present content in true HD, we found the image quality to be great, with only minor brightness and angle adjustments necessary to ensure the best picture for what we were watching. Similarly, we found that the presentation of audio from the laptop's four speakers was stronger than most laptops out there. We expected deeper, richer bass from the laptop, but overall we found that the sound experience was quite good, and we didn't have to crank the volume up very high before we received good sound. On top of that, we could further customize the sound presentation via the movie, 3D content, and music modes from the Beats control panel. Aesthetically, we were impressed by the new design of the DV6 t model, primarily through its gray metallic finish that seemed to repel fingerprints. The machine is very nice to look at, and the overall size of the computer fits comfortably wherever you choose to use it, be that on a desk or in your lap. Speaking of your lap, HP's CoolSense still manages to keep temperatures down during use without the possibility of scorching yourself. We also found the simple pass technology that stored and entered passwords with a swipe of a finger to be somewhat more responsive than previous versions. The other thing that we liked was the fact that HP is offering a large number of varieties of the updated pavilion, meaning many users will be able to get their hands on a newer machine by customizing a system to meet their needs. It may not have the exact same specs as the system we reviewed, but you can still pick up an Ivy Bridge system starting in the mid-600s, with plenty of coupon codes available online to cut you a larger deal. That's a big selling point to help move these machines. We did find some problems with the Pavilion dv 6 t that just couldn't be overlooked. For one thing, weighing in at over 5.5 pounds, it's not one of the lighter laptops out there. That's not to say that you can't get accustomed to the heft of the system, because we managed to slide it in and out of a bag without issues, but it's definitely moving away from the recent trend of lighter systems. Another problem we had was the battery life of the machine, which wasn't close to its reported range. HP claimed that the dv 6 t would get around 6 hours of battery life, but in our tests, we found ourselves lucky to pull down between 3 to 4 hours of use. It can be somewhat disappointing to put the system to sleep, only to find the battery completely drained after a few hours of use. Another issue we had came with the laptop's touchpad, which we didn't particularly like. While we liked the large size of the touchpad, we frequently discovered that its sensitivity could be all over the place one second and sluggish to respond the next. You might find yourself using a mouse for this one instead. Finally, we really couldn't stand the constant stream of pop-ups and updates that seemed to plague the system. Whether we were getting prompted by the HP Support Assistant, Norton Antivirus, or other software, it seemed to continually crop up every few minutes with some new requests. Just expect that you'll have to kill a ton of windows when you're using the machine. 
We found that the HP Pavilion DV-16 managed to get just about everything right, whether it was playing games, watching movies, or getting work done. The audiovisual presentation is very good, and the system is aesthetically appealing. We didn't like how heavy it happened to be, the loads of pop-ups, or the battery life, but overall, the system has pretty impressive performance without breaking the bank. For these reasons, we decided to give the HP Pavilion DV-6 T a 4 out of 5. So, now that we've gone over all the details, how would you like to win this particular system for yourself? Well, it's really easy to do. There are four different ways that you can earn entries for this particular contest. Option one is to like us on our Facebook page. Option two is to follow us on Twitter at TechBargains. Option three is to tweet the following message. Great hashtag giveaway. I just entered to hashtag win an HP DV6 T hashtag laptop from at Tech Bargains and include the following bit.ly that you see on the screen. Option four is to go to techbargains.com and log in or sign up for a brand new user account which earns you one entry into the giveaway. Now each successive day that you return to Tech Bargains and you log in, you earn an additional entry for the contest. Further rules can be found on techbargains.com. The giveaway will start on Monday, July 9th, 2012, and will end on Monday, July 30th, 2012. Good luck to everyone who enters, and for the latest coupons and deals on systems like the HP Pavilion DV6 T, make sure you go to techbargains.com HP. To enter our monthly giveaway like this one, make sure you always go to techbargains.com YouTube, and to watch our video unboxings, video reviews, and exclusive video features, make sure you always check out techbargains.com slash videos.